Holy crap, he's following me. Holy crap, he's following me. Why are you following me? Is he really following me? Or is it just coincidence that he's spinning the same way I'm... He is following me! What creepy asshole! Anyways, what's going on everybody? My name's Chris and welcome back to Let's Play Star Fox Adventures! Last episode we got this Crusoe Spirit and I have no idea how it works. It's like, I just kind of... Are you ready to go I, to I just kind of tapped A somewhat, not even very quickly, just kind of randomly and it just kind of worked. In this episode, we're gonna go to Crusoe's palace and put in a Crusoe spirit and see what that does for me. I'm hoping a lot, right? I hope so, because if it doesn't, I'll be really concerned for my health and well-being. And yeah. Anyways, here we go to Crusoe's palace. Psst, psst. Hmm. Interesting how he's always he's been putting this, for the past two times he's put us in this exact spot. Interesting. Very interesting indeed. Um, we're not gonna have to deal with those assholes, because I mean they're assholes, and who cares about assholes, right? No one wants to deal with an asshole. Not even Star Fox McCloud. <laughs> he only deals with clouds, get it? Because he's Star Fox McCloud. Heh <laughs> heh. I don't get it either. That's okay. Anyways, is there anything down here of interest? You could go down to. I don't know, you could go down to the very bottom. Hmm. Well, totes make sense, bro. Is there anything down here? Hello? Is there anybody down here? No, there's not. I guess this is just if you're stupid and you fall to the bottom like I just did. It's like, ha! No one's gonna fall to the bottom. But just in case, let's put a ladder. Welp. Touche game because I just freaking fell for it. You crazy game. The craziest of all games. I'm just talking to like, you know, filler to like, oh, why is the ladder taking so long? And this ladder itself is long. It's like, Long cat is long. All right, yes it is. Okay, well I guess we need to go up. You like you know that one TV show, and by that TV show I mean the movie. I've yet to see that. I probably should, right? I'm told it's a great. I'm told it's the best love story ever. It's like you know, Up made a better love story in eight minutes than Twilight did in three movies or four movies or whatever. That is no. Twilight. I'm surprised like how many guys have actually said, yeah, I've seen Twilight. Like, you know, I'll be so all sad about it because it's like my girlfriend made me watch it. I'm like, ha! Sucks to be you! I'm just, I don't have a girlfriend, so. Ha! I'll have to watch Twilight! Ha <laughs> Forever alone. <laughs> Anyways, okay, there we go, that's it. Great, that was the most difficult task in the entire game. And Matt, well, that, how many freaking camera angles does this game need? It was like four or five? Something insane like that? There we go, fourth out of seven? Seven or six? I think seven. What a random number. Why seven? Why not ten? Why not five? Why not? I don't know. Anyways, there we go. We saved. We're one that step closer to saving Crystal. At least I'm assuming that's what happens when we get all the Crystal spirits. Yay! Look at those white ass eyes. Like, oh, I'm really hungry. Om nom nom. Thank you, Mr. Crystal Head. Krazoa. Crap Zola. Okay, there we go. Yeah, you just teleport me back. And thank God you caught me. What would happen if you didn't catch me? What if you wasn't ready to catch me? What, what would even happen Box, then? My boy. Three spell stones down and only one to go. Oh good, you could you do second grade math. The hang of this. Now then, it's time for you and Tricky to go to Dragon Rock. You have Who's this? challenge yet. That's easy for you to say, but where do I find the gatekeeper? He is the gatekeeper! He is closer than you realize! He who has no voice has plenty to say! Ah... Uh, that's one of the Thorn Tales, I believe, right? He who has no voice has plenty to say. Whoa! I don't think I could even, like... That is deep, bro! So, I... I'm, I guess that's that one... Thorntail that's like been he doesn't feel like talking right now. Which one was it though? Was it It's not this guy, is it? I don't think so. I think you had stuff to say, right? Like, Where hey, what's up? Found such weapons. Uh I probably crafted them. It's really not that difficult. You just gotta have a wheat stone and some freaking melting iron. It's really not that difficult. I mean, come on, he's a freaking sharp of claws. Is it this guy? It might be this guy actually. I don't think so. I don't remember which one it is. Actually, it might be this one. I don't even. I don't even know, man. 
I hope you're treating the prince well. Oh yes, I am. Look at her. Tricky, just, 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 just there. <laughs> uh, I'm an asshole. Is it you, it's one of these guys. I know it I is. There, there we something go. Odd about you. The warps yeah, this is a guy I've been talking to you for. Uh, I haven't spoken since <laughs> something terrible happened. Something that I am ashamed to admit. I too <laughs> attempted to save our planet, but I failed. Well, Tell me, <sighs> you're a freaking dinosaur. You have opposable thumbs. Dinosaurs against General Scales. He learned of our plan before we could act, and launched a full-scale offensive against us. We never Where to go, shithead! Chance. He imprisoned three of my closest friends on Dragon Rock, and it is also kill them? where he has taken the Spellstone. So how did you survive? If Scales let you go, it could only be because... I am the Gatekeeper. <laughs> So that makes even less sense. Why would he keep the gatekeeper here? That's very true. What? They're all gatekeepers? Why do they all have little the white spirits? Things. Open. Please help my friends. They are on your side. Okay then. Super. Pooper scooper. So that's it. That's literally like now we can go to the next planet, and there's like what two, maybe three episodes in between that. See this game, it, it, like for the first two spell stones, I'd say it's pretty well developed. Like there's quite a bit of stuff to do in between, and this one it's like keep. You got um, you got spell stone. Get that soul spirit. Now go to the next place. Let's go. Chop, 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 chop. It's not like not very like well developed. It's yeah, it's like more like straight to the point. Not very like unique characters. Like it's just a typical Thorntail guy that just is the final gatekeeper. Which is, I mean, t it, ha it has its good things too. Like I mean, it's kind of, it's unpredictable in that sense. Like who would have freaking thought? Like just the typical freaking dude is like been the gatekeeper all along. General Scales has unleashed the full force of the planet's dark enemy, mutating Dragon Rock into a desolate wasteland. He's captured a number of dinosaurs and is planning to change them into powerful killing machines. It's rumored that one such creature already exists. This final spellstorm will bring dinosaur planet back together. Flip it out! Yay! Even though we only have four out of seven Crusoe spirits, which is interesting. Ten gold rings! If you like it, then you should have put a ring on it. I've never made that reference before in my life. Okay, so we're gonna grab the bomb, then we're gonna grab the freaking. I missed it! Great! We missed the easiest one to get. Great, ah, freaking fan. Fudging tastic. Okay, just freaking. No, oh, there we go. Ah, oh, yeah, you boost through. You boost through. Moit. Give me that. Give me that. Put it. Put it around my ship. Put it around my. Okay, blow up. There we go. Okay. Right, super. Uh, back up, back up, back up, back up. Oh, I know, so you don't even tell me. Oh, stop, you're making me blush. <laughs> ah, what? Oh, jeez, I got stuck on the great thing. That wasn't very great at all. <laughs> so, yes, there we go. These guys are like spinning vampires. Look at they have little capes and they're spinning like, ah, they're like little bee vampires. They're one of the oh crap, did I fail? I failed! Uh oh. Okay, well now you guys got to see what happens when you be stupid like I am and miss the first gold ring. It's like, how do you miss the first gold It's right in front of you. Good lord, I'm silly. Sometimes I just like to be silly. Who even knows why? I don't even know, bro. Bro, 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 bro. See, I don't even know if I'm gonna cut this out either now. It's like, why would I? I mean, it's like two seconds, but at the same time, it's like two seconds that could be added to the freaking let's play of the. I don't know. I, uh, sometimes I start to say something and I don't even know what I'm trying to say, and then I just don't say. Okay, we want that. We want that. We don't want to miss any gold rings. Okay. 
I don't believe there's I missed a gold ring because of that. Did I? I sure hope not. I found one to have nine and then failed again. Since they definitely seem very skimpy on the gold rings. So it might be exactly ten on every set path. Okay, don't get stuck in the grade again like a stupid, stupid, stupid. Did I? Okay, there we go. Uh, we got it. We got this. We got it. Unless I missed that, which I didn't. Shut up, Slippy! I know I'm doing a good job. You don't have to tell me, okay? Okay? Okay. I don't even care. Just give it to me. There we go. Perfect. Oh, I know I did it. Oh, times ten? Holy crap. Thankfully, it told me I got times ten gold rings. I'm stretching. <sighs> Did you even tell me how many gold rings I got on the other ones? I don't think so. Look up to Dragon Frock or whatever it's called. I don't remember this place at all. I saw a screenshot of this place a little while ago and I know what the boss is. I don't remember the boss at all. Like before I saw the boss skin, I didn't even know what the boss was in this place. I, I completely forgot it existed. That's funny though, like the top comment in that video what showed the boss. It literally um, the top comment was, I completely forgot about this guy, and like, you know, obviously a lot of people thumbs it up, but apparently more, everyone forgot about him. But interestingly enough, the boss of this place was originally supposed to be the original, like, boss of this place. What the fudge are these? I almost swore for no reason. Why am I swearing all of a sudden, bro? Don't even know. But yep, in the next episode, we will start to tackle Drake. What's this place called? What's this place called? Dragon Rock, okay. I thought it was like Dragon something rock, not just simply Dragon Rock. Okay, so there's a mushroom that we don't actually need. So yeah, in the next episode we shall tackle Dragon Rock and see what we can find. And interesting. Very interesting. I like to use constant lightning as a power source, apparently. But yep, thanks a lot for watching. If you enjoyed, please feel free to leave a like, subscribe, and my name's Chris, and I will see you guys next episode. Peace!